Hello and welcome to Ayurveda Plated. Does eating rice make you feel heavy? In this video, I'm going to show how I cook rice so it is light and easy to digest. Newly harvested rice is hard to digest but aged rice that is rice which is old by at least one year is lighter. Additionally, dry roasting the rice and cooking in an open pot and draining the starch will make it lighter to digest. To begin with, I am going to fill my open pot with hot water. I always preheat the water from kettle, that way the water starts boiling quickly. The kind of rice I use on a regular basis is Ambe Mor, but Sona Masuri or any short grain rice variety can also be a great option. So here I have taken a cup of rice. Cooking the rice just on the open pot itself is very light and easy on our digestion. So here I haven't dry roasted it, but additionally it can also be dry roasted to make the rice even lighter. Now I am going to wash the rice thoroughly and discard the water. Once the water starts boiling, I'm going to slowly and carefully add the rice to the boiling water. In the traditional stout top cooking, all the five elements namely earth, water, fire, air and space combine to cook food properly and make it easier to digest. There is no air circulation or space in pressure cooking as all of that stays stuck in the cooker, making the food heavier. With our busy lives, sometimes it is difficult for us to cook rice this way in an open pot. When cooking rice using an instant pot or pressure cooker to make it light, digestive spices like either cumin or a cardamom pot or a bay leaf or one clove or a cinnamon stick can be added. After giving it a quick mix, I'm going to let the rice cook on a medium flame until the rice turns soft and tender. Rice contributes the sweet taste according to Ayurveda. It is light, soft, smooth and nourishing food. It is cooling in nature. Now the rice is perfectly cooked and it is soft and tender, I am going to drain the starch and discard the water. Here I have used a colander to drain the starch and allow the rice to rest in the colander for at least 5 minutes for all the excess water to drain completely so the rice doesn't get bushy. Again, this starch water has many benefits as well. This starch water can be taken during fever, indigestion instead of rice. After all of the starch has been drained completely, I have transferred the rice to the vessel. Cooking the rice this way in an open pot and discarding the excess starch after cooking the rice makes the quality of the rice very light and easy to digest. Hope you guys like this video. If you do find these recipes useful and wanted to know more recipes Ayurvedic way, please do subscribe to my channel.